good morning one and all i'm batma priya assistant professor in department of csc of rmd engineering college today we are going to see the topic contracts in supply chain management under the subject supply chain management there are three different types of contract in supply chain management they are buyback contract revenue sharing contract and quantity flexibility contract now let us see about the first contract buyback contract a buyback or return means a uh, allows a retailer to retain return unsold inventory up to a specified amount at an agreed upon price in a buyback contract the manufacturer will specify a wholesale price c along with the buyback price b at which the retailer can return any unsold units at the end of the season by doing so they have two types of advantage that is the holding cost subsidies and the price support since the manufacturer pays the retailers a certain amount for every unit held in the inventory over a given period it encourages the retailers to order more and also the manufacturer share the risk of product becoming obsolete and also guarantee that in the event they drop the prices and also lower the prices for all the current inventories the next contract is revenue sharing contract in revenue sharing contract the manufacturer charges the retailer a low wholesale price c and shares a fraction f of the retailer's revenue if no returns are allowed the lower wholesale price decreases the cost to the retailer in case of an overstock the retailer increases the level of product availability resulting in higher profit for both the manufacturer and the retailer it allows both the manufacturer and retailer to increase their profits and result in lower retailer effort it requires an information infrastructure and the information distortion results in excess inventory in the supply chain and a greater mismatch of supply and demand the next contract is quantity flexibility contract under the quantity flexibility contract the manufacturer allows the retailer to change the quantity ordered after observing the demand the retailer can purchase up to q units depending on the demand it observes these contracts are similar to buyback contracts in that manufacturer but bear the some of the risk of having excess inventory because no returns are required these contracts can be more effective than the buyback contract when the cost of return is going to be high the quantity flexibility contract increase the average amount the retailer purchase and also increase the total supply chain profits this quantity flexibility contracts also allows the buyer to modify the order after observing the demand it better matches the supply and demand and it has increased supply chain profit if the supplier has flexible capacity and have lower levels of information distortion than either in the buyback contract or revenue sharing contracts so this is with the three types of contracts in supply chain management thank you